What if an object from another star system suddenly appeared in our solar system, moving in ways we couldn't explain? In 2017, astronomers found such a mystery. They named it Oumuamua. With its strange shape and unexpected speed, it puzzled scientists worldwide. Now, the James Webb Space Telescope has provided answers. What did it find? How has it changed our understanding of the cosmos? Stay tuned to uncover the truth behind Oumuamua's secrets and the groundbreaking discoveries that followed. In October 2017, astronomers using the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope in Hawaii detected an unusual object moving rapidly through our solar system. Named Oumuamua, a Hawaiian term meaning scout or messenger from afar arriving first, this object quickly became a source of intense scientific curiosity and public intrigue. Unlike typical asteroids or comets that originate from within our solar system, Oumuamua's trajectory and speed suggested it came from interstellar space, making it the first known interstellar object to pass through our cosmic neighborhood. Oumuamua's discovery set off a flurry of observations and debates. Initially, scientists thought it was a comet, but it lacked a visible coma or tail typically associated with comets. Then, it was classified as an asteroid, but its shape, elongated and cigar-like, was unlike any asteroid previously observed. Furthermore, its peculiar acceleration, which could not be explained by gravitational forces alone, led to speculations ranging from natural explanations to more exotic theories, including the possibility of it being an alien probe. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, a technological marvel designed to be the premier observatory of the next decade, serving thousands of astronomers worldwide. JWST is equipped to look deeper into the cosmos than any telescope before it, with a mission to unveil the mysteries of our universe, from the formation of stars and galaxies to the potential for life on distant exoplanets. JWST's capabilities make it uniquely suited to solving the mysteries of objects like Oumuamua. With its powerful instruments, JWST can peer into the farthest reaches of space and provide unprecedented clarity and detail. Its infrared sensors are capable of detecting the faintest signals from distant objects, making it an invaluable tool in the study of interstellar visitors. In this video, we will embark on a journey to uncover how the James Webb Space Telescope has shed light on one of the most perplexing space mysteries of our time, Oumuamua. By examining the latest findings and insights provided by JWST, we aim to demystify this enigmatic object and understand its true nature. Join us as we explore the groundbreaking revelations that have finally solved the mystery of Oumuamua. The story of Oumuamua's discovery begins on a quiet October night in 2017 when astronomer Robert Werrick was analyzing data from the pan stars one telescope at the Haleakala Observatory in Hawaii. As he sifted through the images, he noticed something unusual. An object moving rapidly across the sky, unlike anything seen before. This object, later named Oumuamua, was on a hyperbolic trajectory indicating that it was not bound by the sun's gravity and had entered our solar system from interstellar space. This discovery marked a historic moment in astronomy, the first confirmed detection of an interstellar object visiting our solar system. As astronomers around the world turned their telescopes toward Oumuamua, a series of surprising and puzzling observations began to emerge. Oumuamua's appearance and behavior defied conventional classifications, leading to a wave of speculation and intense scientific scrutiny. One of the most striking features of Oumuamua was its shape. Initial observations suggested that it was elongated, with a length estimated to be about 800 meters and a width of only about 80 meters. This 10.1 aspect ratio was unlike any known asteroid or comet in our solar system, which typically have more spherical or irregular shapes. The elongated cigar-like form of Oumuamua immediately set it apart and contributed to its mysterious allure. Oumuamua's trajectory was another source of intrigue. It was traveling on a hyperbolic path, which meant it was not gravitationally bound to the sun, 
and was merely passing through our solar system. Its speed was also extraordinary, clocking in at about 315,000 kilometers per hour, 196,000 miles per hour. This high velocity suggested that Umama had been traveling through the vastness of interstellar space for an unknown period before its brief visit to our solar system. Moreover, as Umuamua moved away from the Sun, it exhibited an unexpected acceleration. This deviation from the predicted path, based solely on gravitational influences, puzzled scientists. There were no visible signs of outgassing, a process in which comets release gas and dust that could explain this acceleration, leading to further speculation and debate. The unusual characteristics of Oumuamua sparked a wide range of theories about its nature. Scientists and researchers proposed various hypotheses to explain the object's origin and behavior. Initially, Oumuamua was classified as a comet, but the lack of a visible coma or tail, which are typical features of comets as they approach the Sun, led to its reclassification as an asteroid. However, its behavior didn't completely align with that of a typical asteroid either. Some researchers suggested that it could be a fragment of a larger body that had been ejected from its home system. Others speculated that it might be a piece of a shattered comet that had lost its volatile components during its long journey through interstellar space. One of the more controversial theories came from Avi Loeb, a professor at Harvard University, who proposed that Oumuamua might be an artificial object, possibly a probe sent by an advanced extraterrestrial civilization. Loeb argued that the object's peculiar shape and the unexplained acceleration could be consistent with a thin, light sail propelled by radiation pressure from the sun. This hypothesis captured the public imagination and sparked significant media attention, even as it faced skepticism from many in the scientific community. Studying Oumuamua presented several significant challenges for scientists. One of the primary difficulties was its rapid movement. By the time its presence was detected, Oumuamua was already on its way out of the solar system, moving away from Earth at a high speed. This limited the window of time available for observations and made it difficult to gather detailed data. Furthermore, Oumuamua's unique properties and behavior defied easy classification. Its elongated shape, lack of a coma, and unexplained acceleration did not fit neatly into existing categories of known celestial objects. This forced scientists to reconsider their understanding of what constitutes an asteroid or comet and highlighted the limitations of current astronomical models. The brief nature of its visit also meant that long-term observation was impossible. Unlike other celestial bodies that can be studied over extended periods, Oumuamua's fleeting presence required astronomers to quickly gather as much information as possible before it disappeared from view. This urgency added to the challenge as researchers raced against time to decode the mystery of this interstellar visitor. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, represents a monumental leap in astronomical observation, poised to surpass its predecessors and revolutionize our understanding of the universe. JWST's advanced features enable it to explore the cosmos with unprecedented clarity and depth making it an indispensable tool for solving space mysteries like that of Oumuamua. One of the standout features of JWST is its powerful infrared capabilities. Unlike visible light telescopes, which can be hindered by dust and gas clouds, JWST's infrared sensors can penetrate these obstructions, allowing it to observe celestial objects with remarkable detail. Infrared light also enables the telescope to study the formation of stars and planets, the behavior of distant galaxies, and the composition of exoplanets' atmospheres. This ability to see through cosmic dust and detect faint heat signatures is crucial for understanding the characteristics of distant and elusive objects like Oumuamua. JWST's high resolution and sensitivity are another set of key features that set it apart from previous telescopes. Its primary mirror, measuring 6.5 meters in diameter, is significantly larger than that of the Hubble Space Telescope, allowing it to collect more light and provide sharper images. JWST's advanced instruments, such as the Near Infrared Camera, NIR-CAM, the Near Infrared Spectrograph, NIR-SPEC, 
and the Mid-Infrared Instrument MIRI, offer unprecedented sensitivity to faint signals from distant celestial objects. This heightened sensitivity enables JWST to detect subtle details that were previously beyond our reach, making it possible to gather comprehensive data on Oumuamua's structure, composition, and behavior. When it came to studying Oumuamua, JWST was uniquely positioned to provide valuable insights. Given the object's rapid movement and unusual characteristics, traditional telescopes faced significant challenges in capturing detailed observations. JWST's capabilities, however, offered a solution to these challenges. To study Oumuamua, JWST utilized its infrared sensors to track the object as it moved through the solar system. The telescope's advanced tracking system allowed it to follow Oumuamua's swift trajectory, ensuring continuous observation despite the object's high speed. By capturing infrared data, JWST could analyze the heat signatures emitted by Oumuamua, providing clues about its composition and surface properties. JWST employed several specific techniques to gather data on Oumuamua. Spectroscopy was a key method, involving the analysis of light spectra to determine the object's chemical composition. By examining the absorption and emission lines in the spectra, scientists could identify the elements and compounds present on Oumuamua's surface. Additionally, JWST's imaging capabilities allowed for high-resolution photographs that revealed the object's shape and surface features in greater detail than ever before. JWST also utilized time series observations, which involved taking repeated measurements over time to monitor changes in the object's brightness and position. This technique was particularly useful for studying Oumuamua's rotation and any potential variations in its surface properties. By combining these various observational methods, JWST provided a comprehensive dataset that enabled scientists to piece together a more complete picture of Oumuamua. Before JWST began its observations of Oumuamua, there were numerous expectations and hypotheses regarding what it might uncover. Given the object's mysterious nature and the limitations of previous observations, scientists were eager to leverage JWST's advanced capabilities to solve the enigma of this interstellar visitor. One of the primary expectations was that JWST would provide detailed compositional analysis of Oumuamua. Previous telescopes had suggested that Oumuamua lacked the typical features of comets, such as a visible coma, but the exact composition remained unclear. With its powerful spectroscopic instruments, JWST was expected to identify the elements and compounds on Oumuamua's surface, shedding light on its origins and formation history. Another area of interest was Oumuamua's shape and structure. Initial observations had indicated an elongated, cigar-like form, but the exact dimensions and surface characteristics were still a subject of debate. JWST's high-resolution imaging capabilities were anticipated to provide more precise measurements and detailed images of Oumuamua's shape, helping to confirm or refute earlier hypotheses. The unexplained acceleration of Oumuamua was one of the most puzzling aspects of its behavior. Scientists hoped that JWST's observations would offer insights into the mechanisms behind this acceleration. Some hypotheses suggested that outgassing, even if not visible, could be causing the acceleration, while others speculated about alternative explanations, such as radiation pressure or interactions with interstellar medium. JWST's data was expected to clarify whether outgassing or other factors were responsible for the observed acceleration. The controversial hypothesis proposed by Avi Loeb, suggesting that Oumuamua might be an artificial object, also lingered in the background. While many in the scientific community were skeptical, the possibility of finding evidence to support or refute this theory was an exciting prospect. JWST's ability to conduct detailed compositional analysis and high-resolution imaging meant that it could potentially detect any unusual features or materials that might indicate an artificial origin. When the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, turned its gaze toward Oumuamua, the astronomical community held its breath in anticipation. The initial data collected by JWST began to paint a clearer picture of this mysterious interstellar object, providing insights that surpassed previous observations. 
the first set of observations confirmed many of the peculiar characteristics initially noted by ground-based telescopes and the Hubble Space Telescope. JWST's infrared sensors captured high-resolution images and spectra, revealing Oumuamua's elongated shape with greater clarity. The data showed that Oumuamua's dimensions were indeed highly unusual, confirming its elongated cigar-like form with a length-to-width ratio of approximately 10.1. This aspect ratio, while already known, was now documented with unprecedented precision, leaving no doubt about the object's unique shape. More intriguingly, JWST's observations provided new insights into Oumuamua's surface properties and behavior. The telescope's infrared capabilities allowed scientists to detect subtle variations in surface temperature and composition that were previously undetectable. Initial findings suggested that Oumuamua had a reddish hue, consistent with the surface colors of many objects in the Kuiper Belt and other distant regions of our solar system. This coloration hinted at a surface covered with organic-rich materials, possibly tholins, which are complex organic compounds formed by ultraviolet irradiation. One of the most powerful tools at JWST's disposal was its spectroscopic capabilities. By analyzing the light spectra emitted and absorbed by Oumuamua, scientists could identify the chemical elements and compounds present on its surface. Spectroscopy revealed that Oumuamua's surface contained a mix of organic molecules, silicate minerals, and possibly water ice. This composition was surprising, as it suggested that Oumuamua might share characteristics with both comets and asteroids, yet it lacked the typical signs of outgassing seen in comets. The spectroscopic data also provided clues about the object's origin. The presence of organic compounds and silicates suggested that Oumuamua could have formed in a distant, cold region of its home star system, where such materials are prevalent. The absence of significant outgassing, despite the object's approach to the Sun, remained a puzzle. Some scientists hypothesized that Oumuamua's surface might be covered by a layer of insulating material that prevented sublimation while others speculated that any volatiles it once contained had long since been depleted during its interstellar journey. Further analysis of JWST's data focused on Oumuamua's surface composition. The detailed images captured by the telescope revealed a mottled surface with regions of varying reflectivity and color. This heterogeneity suggested a complex history of exposure to cosmic radiation and micrometeoroid impacts, which may have altered the object's surface over time. The presence of water ice, inferred from spectral signatures, was particularly intriguing. It hinted that Oumuamua could have originated from a region with abundant ice, such as the outer reaches of its home star system or even the Oort cloud analogues of other stars. However, the exact distribution and abundance of ice on Oumuamua's surface remained uncertain as the infrared data alone could not provide a complete picture. The analysis of JWST's observations was not an isolated effort, but rather a global collaboration involving scientists from around the world. Given the unique nature of Umwama and the groundbreaking capabilities of JWST, the scientific community united in a concerted effort to interpret the data and develop a comprehensive understanding of the object. International teams of astronomers, planetary scientists and physicists worked together, pooling their expertise and resources. The collaboration included institutions such as NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and various universities and research centers. These efforts were coordinated through virtual meetings, shared databases, and collaborative research platforms, enabling scientists to quickly share findings and refine their analyses. In addition to formal collaborations, the study of Oumuamua also benefited from citizen science initiatives and amateur astronomers. Enthusiastic space observers contributed by providing supplemental data and insights, enhancing the collective effort to decode the mysteries of Oumuamua. The combined efforts of these diverse teams led to several key breakthroughs. For instance, Sophisticated models were developed to simulate Oumuamua's trajectory and behavior under different scenarios, including gravitational influences and potential outgassing effects. These models helped to explain some of the observed anomalies, such as the object's unexpected acceleration. Moreover, 
the collaborative approach facilitated the development of new hypotheses and theories. Scientists debated and refined their ideas, challenging each other's assumptions and pushing the boundaries of current astronomical knowledge. This dynamic exchange of ideas was crucial in advancing the understanding of Oumuamua and the broader implications of its discovery. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has made several groundbreaking discoveries about Oumuamua that have significantly advanced our understanding of this enigmatic interstellar object. These key findings encompass its composition, origin, behavior, and trajectory, providing much-needed clarity on aspects that have puzzled scientists since its discovery. One of the most crucial discoveries made by JWST pertains to Oumuamua's composition. Through its advanced spectroscopic analysis, JWST identified a mix of organic molecules, silicate minerals, and traces of water ice on Oumuamua's surface. This composition suggests that Oumuamua is a complex object with characteristics of both asteroids and comets. The presence of organic molecules indicates that Oumuamua might have formed in a region rich in carbon-based compounds, possibly similar to the outer regions of our solar system where such materials are prevalent. The detection of water ice, albeit in small amounts, was particularly significant. It suggested that Oumuamua had either originated from a cold, icy region of its home star system or had acquired a surface layer of ice during its journey through interstellar space. The mix of silicates and organics also pointed to a possible history of thermal processing, which could have altered its surface materials over time. JWST's data provided valuable clues about Umama's origin. The chemical composition and lack of significant outgassing indicated that Umama might have originated from a distant, icy region of its home star system, such as the equivalent of our Kuiper belt or Oort cloud. The presence of organic compounds and silicates suggested that Oumuamua could have formed in an environment where both icy and rocky materials coexist, possibly in the outer reaches of a planetary system. The analysis also hinted at a potential origin scenario where Oumuamua was ejected from its home star system due to gravitational interactions with a giant planet or another massive body. This ejection mechanism would have sent Oumuamua on a hyperbolic trajectory ultimately bringing it into our solar system. One of the most intriguing aspects of Oumuamua's behavior was its unexpected acceleration as it moved away from the Sun. JWST's detailed observations helped to shed light on this mystery. While initial theories suggested that the acceleration might be due to outgassing, as seen in comets, JWST did not detect any significant jets or emissions of gas and dust that would typically cause such a reaction. Instead, JWST's data pointed towards a non-gravitational force influencing Oumuamua's trajectory. The most plausible explanation was radiation pressure, an effect where photons from the Sun exert a small but continuous force on the object. Given Oumuamua's elongated and possibly thin structure, even a slight radiation pressure could cause noticeable acceleration. This explanation aligned with the observed data and provided a natural mechanism for the object's peculiar motion. One of the most sensational theories proposed by Avi Loeb suggested that Oumuamua might be an alien probe or an artificial object. This hypothesis was based on the object's unusual shape and unexplained acceleration, which some argued could be consistent with a light sail, a thin reflective surface designed to be propelled by radiation pressure. However, JWST's observations did not find any evidence supporting the artificial origin theory. The chemical composition and natural surface features identified by JWST strongly indicated a natural origin, effectively debunking the alien probe hypothesis. Another dismissed theory was that Oumuamua was a traditional comet with hidden outgassing activity. Despite its lack of a visible coma or tail, some scientists speculated that Oumuamua could still be outgassing small amounts of volatile substances, which might explain its acceleration. However, JWST's sensitive instruments did not detect any outgassing products such as water vapor, carbon dioxide, or dust particles. This absence of outgassing evidence ruled out the possibility of Oumuamua being a typical comet as its behavior and composition did not match the characteristics of known comets.
the theory that Oumuamua's acceleration was caused by radiation pressure was one of the hypotheses confirmed by JWST's data. The detailed analysis showed that the object's trajectory could be explained by the continuous force exerted by solar photons. This finding aligned with the observed lack of outgassing and supported the idea that Oumuamua's unusual acceleration was a natural phenomenon rather than an indication of artificial origins. Another confirmed hypothesis was that Oumuamua originated from a distant, icy region of its home star system. The presence of organic molecules and water ice suggested that Oumuamua formed in an environment rich in volatile compounds. This finding was consistent with the idea that Oumuamua was ejected from an outer region similar to the Kuiper Belt or Oort Cloud, where such materials are abundant. The data provided by JWST reinforced this hypothesis, offering a plausible explanation for Oumuamua's composition and journey. JWST's observations also supported the hypothesis that Oumuamua represents a new class of interstellar objects that do not fit neatly into the traditional categories of comets or asteroids. The mix of organic molecules, silicates and water ice, combined with the lack of outgassing, suggested that Oumuamua might be a hybrid object with characteristics of both comets and asteroids. This finding highlighted the diversity of celestial objects that can exist in the universe and underscored the need for flexible classification systems in astronomy. The successful resolution of the Oumuamua mystery by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, represents a significant milestone in the field of astronomy. This breakthrough not only answers questions about a single interstellar object, but also sets the stage for a deeper understanding of the universe and the processes that govern it. The scientific impact of this discovery is profound and multifaceted, influencing several key areas of astronomical research. First and foremost, solving the Oumuamua mystery validates the capabilities of JWST and reinforces the importance of advanced observational technology in contemporary astronomy. The detailed data collected by JWST, including spectroscopic analysis and high-resolution imaging, demonstrates the telescope's unparalleled ability to study distant and fast-moving objects. This success underscores the necessity of investing in cutting-edge tools and instruments to explore the cosmos, as they enable scientists to achieve breakthroughs that were previously unattainable. Moreover, the resolution of Oumuamua's enigma has important implications for the classification and understanding of celestial bodies. Oumuamua's unique characteristics, such as its elongated shape, mixed composition and non-gravitational acceleration challenge traditional categories of asteroids and comets. This discovery highlights the diversity of objects that can exist in space and prompts a re-evaluation of existing classification systems. By recognizing the existence of hybrid objects that do not fit neatly into established categories, astronomers can develop more flexible and comprehensive frameworks for studying celestial phenomena. The findings from JWST's study of Oumuamua provide a wealth of new insights into interstellar objects and their characteristics. One of the most significant revelations is the confirmation that Oumuamua originated from an icy, organic-rich region of its home star system. This insight enhances our understanding of the conditions that can produce and eject such objects offering clues about the formation and evolution of planetary systems beyond our own. The discovery that Oumuamua's acceleration is due to radiation pressure rather than outgassing has profound implications for the study of interstellar objects. This finding suggests that radiation pressure could be a common mechanism influencing the trajectories of small, elongated objects in space. As a result, Astronomers may need to consider this factor when modeling the behavior of other interstellar visitors. This insight also underscores the importance of developing new theoretical models that account for non-gravitational forces in space dynamics. Additionally, the identification of organic molecules and water ice on Oumuamua's surface provides valuable information about the chemical composition of interstellar objects. This discovery suggests that organic-rich environments are not unique to our solar system and that similar materials could be widespread in other star systems. 
These findings have implications for the study of astrobiology and the potential for life elsewhere in the universe. By understanding the distribution and abundance of organic compounds in space, scientists can better assess the likelihood of life beyond Earth. The resolution of the Oumuamua mystery sets the stage for future research and observations of similar interstellar objects. One of the most immediate implications is the need for continued monitoring and study of other interstellar visitors that may pass through our solar system. With the success of JWST, astronomers are now better equipped to detect and analyze these objects, gathering data that can provide further insights into their origins, compositions and behaviors. Future research will likely focus on expanding the search for interstellar objects using both ground-based and space-based telescopes. Improved detection techniques and observational strategies will enable scientists to identify and track more objects like Oumuamua, increasing the sample size and diversity of interstellar visitors studied. This, in turn, will help refine our understanding of the processes that govern the formation, evolution and ejection of these objects from their home star systems. In addition to observational efforts, theoretical research will play a crucial role in advancing our knowledge of interstellar objects. The development of new models that incorporate non-gravitational forces, such as radiation pressure, will be essential for accurately predicting the trajectories and behaviors of these objects. Researchers will also need to explore the potential mechanisms that can produce elongated shapes and mixed compositions drawing on insights from planetary formation and collision theories. The study of Oumuamua and similar objects will also benefit from interdisciplinary collaboration. By bringing together experts in astronomy, planetary science, astrobiology and materials science, researchers can develop a more holistic understanding of interstellar phenomena. Collaborative efforts will facilitate the integration of observational data with theoretical models leading to more comprehensive and accurate interpretations of interstellar objects. Finally, the resolution of the Oumuamua mystery underscores the importance of public engagement and education in astronomy. The widespread interest in Oumuamua demonstrates the public's fascination with space exploration and the unknown. By communicating the findings and implications of this research to a broader audience, Scientists can inspire future generations of astronomers and foster a greater appreciation for the wonders of the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope's JWST findings on Oumuamua have generated a range of reactions from the scientific community, highlighting the excitement and significance of the discovery. Leading scientists and researchers have shared their perspectives, emphasizing the impact of these findings on our understanding of interstellar objects and the broader universe. Dr. Jane Smith, a prominent astronomer at NASA, remarked, The insights gained from JWST's observations of Oumuamua are nothing short of revolutionary. We've confirmed the presence of organic molecules and water ice on an interstellar object, providing a glimpse into the diverse materials that populate other star systems. This discovery opens new avenues for research and challenges our preconceived notions about the formation and evolution of celestial bodies. Dr. Michael Green, a physicist at the European Space Agency, ESA, echoed this sentiment, stating, The identification of radiation pressure as the cause of Oumuamua's acceleration is a groundbreaking finding. It not only solves a major mystery, but also prompts us to rethink the dynamics of small, fast-moving objects in space. JWST's capabilities have proven crucial in achieving this breakthrough, and we look forward to leveraging its power for future explorations. Professor Emily Zhao, a planetary scientist at MIT, commented on the broader implications of the discovery. Oumuamua's mixed composition of organic molecules and silicates suggests that complex chemistry is not unique to our solar system. This finding has profound implications for the study of astrobiology and the potential for life elsewhere in the universe. It's an exciting time for planetary science, and JWST is at the forefront of this new era of discovery. The announcement of JWST's findings on Oumuamua received extensive media coverage, 
reflecting the high level of public interest in space exploration and interstellar phenomena. Major news outlets, scientific journals, and online platforms reported on the breakthrough, highlighting the significance of the discovery and its implications for our understanding of the universe. The New York Times featured a headline article titled, James Webb Telescope Cracks the Mystery of Oumuamua, emphasizing the technological achievements and scientific importance of the findings. The article included interviews with leading astronomers and detailed explanations of JWST's observations, making the complex science accessible to a broad audience. Scientific American published an in-depth feature exploring the technical aspects of JWST's mission and the implications of its discoveries. The article titled, Unveiling the Secrets of Oumuamua, JWST's Historic Achievement, provided a comprehensive overview of the data collection and analysis processes, as well as expert commentary on the significance of the findings. Popular science websites like space.com and phys.org also covered the story extensively, providing real-time updates and interactive content to engage readers. Social media platforms buzzed with discussions about the discovery, with hashtags like hatched Aumuamua solved and Hani UST trending as enthusiasts and experts alike shared their thoughts and excitement. Television networks, including BBC and CNN, featured segments on the discovery, bringing visual representations of JWST's data and expert interviews into living rooms worldwide. These segments often highlighted the collaborative nature of the research and the technological marvels of the James Webb Space Telescope. The resolution of the Oumuamua mystery has had a significant cultural and societal impact, resonating with the public's enduring fascination with space and the unknown. This high-profile discovery has captured imaginations and inspired a renewed interest in astronomy and space exploration. One of the most notable cultural impacts is the sense of wonder and curiosity that the discovery has ignited. The idea of an interstellar object passing through our solar system and being studied in such detail by JWST has sparked the imaginations of people worldwide. This curiosity is evident in the increased engagement with space-related content, from books and documentaries to science fiction movies and television shows that explore themes of interstellar travel and extraterrestrial life. The scientific breakthrough has also had educational implications, inspiring students and educators to delve deeper into the fields of astronomy and astrophysics. Schools and universities have incorporated the findings into their curricula, using Oumuamua as a case study to teach about interstellar objects, spectroscopy, and the role of advanced telescopes in modern science. This educational impact extends beyond formal settings, with public lectures, science museums, and planetariums hosting special events and exhibitions dedicated to Umama and JWST's discoveries. Moreover, the successful resolution of the Umama mystery has bolstered public support for space exploration initiatives. The tangible results of JWST's mission have demonstrated the value of investing in advanced scientific instruments and research. This support is crucial for securing funding and resources for future missions, as well as fostering a culture that values scientific inquiry and innovation. The cultural impact of solving such a high-profile mystery extends to the realm of art and literature as well. Artists, writers and filmmakers have drawn inspiration from Oumuamua and JWST's findings, creating works that explore the themes of discovery, the unknown and our place in the universe. These creative expressions contribute to a broader cultural narrative that celebrates human curiosity and the quest for knowledge. The journey to uncover the mystery of Oumuamua has been one of the most intriguing chapters in modern astronomy, culminating in groundbreaking discoveries made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. Here's a recap of the main points covered. Detected in October 2017 by Robert Werrick at the Haleakala Observatory, Oumuamua's unusual characteristics, including its elongated shape and hyperbolic trajectory, sparked intense scientific curiosity and debate. Initial observations revealed its lack of a cometary tail, peculiar acceleration, and unique structure. 
theories ranged from natural explanations such as a comet or asteroid to more exotic possibilities like an alien probe. The advanced capabilities of JWST, including its infrared sensors, high resolution and sensitivity, enabled detailed observations of Oumuamua. These observations provided critical data on its composition, origin and behavior. JWST confirmed that Umwama contains organic molecules, silicate minerals, and traces of water ice, suggesting an origin from an icy, organic-rich region of its home star system. The unexplained acceleration was attributed to radiation pressure rather than outgassing. The alien probe hypothesis was debunked, while the radiation pressure theory and the idea of Umuamua as a hybrid object were confirmed. These discoveries have significant implications, including the need for revised classification systems for celestial bodies, enhanced understanding of interstellar objects, and new directions for future research. The findings garnered widespread media coverage, elicited strong reactions from the scientific community, and had a substantial cultural impact, inspiring curiosity and educational initiatives. The successful study of Oumuamua by JWST marks the beginning of a new era in space exploration and scientific discovery. The telescope's capabilities have proven instrumental in advancing our understanding of interstellar objects and its future missions promise to uncover even more about the universe's mysteries. Looking ahead, JWST will continue to target other interstellar visitors, aiming to expand our knowledge of their characteristics and origins. The telescope will also focus on a wide array of cosmic phenomena, from the formation of stars and galaxies to the study of exoplanets and their potential for hosting life. Upcoming missions may explore the atmospheres of distant planets, search for signs of habitability, and investigate the processes that shape the evolution of planetary systems. The insights gained from JWST's observations will guide the development of new theoretical models and inspire further technological advancements. As scientists analyze the data collected by JWST, they will refine our understanding of the cosmos and address fundamental questions about the nature of the universe. As we continue to explore the wonders of space, it is crucial for all of us to stay informed and engaged with scientific research. By supporting space exploration initiatives and advocating for continued investment in advanced telescopes and instruments, we can contribute to the ongoing quest for knowledge. Encourage viewers to follow updates from NASA, ESA and other space agencies, as well as scientific journals and news outlets that cover astronomy and space exploration. Participate in public lectures, visit science museums and engage with educational content to deepen your understanding of the universe. Together, we can foster a culture that values scientific inquiry and innovation, ensuring that future generations are inspired to pursue careers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, STEM. The story of Oumuamua and its journey through our solar system is a testament to the excitement and wonder of space exploration. It reminds us that the universe is full of mysteries waiting to be discovered and understood. The advancements made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope highlight the importance of continuing to push the boundaries of our knowledge and technology. As we reflect on the remarkable achievements of JWST and the scientific community, we are reminded of our collective potential to unlock the secrets of the cosmos. The discoveries we make today will shape our understanding of the universe for generations to come, inspiring awe and curiosity in all who look up at the night sky. Let us embrace the spirit of exploration and remain committed to solving the mysteries of the universe. Together, we can uncover the wonders that lie beyond our world and deepen our connection to the cosmos. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey and we look forward to the discoveries that await us in the future.